I want to say some things to you about your daughter. What I'm concerned about is her self-image. And self-image is the perception or mental picture mm -hmm. that you have, your appearance, abilities, and personal worth. And I think when someone feels like they have to have all of these things in order to feel like they're presentable, to feel like they're worthy, to feel like they can be acceptable, then they don't have much self-worth. Well, my mom made me feel that way. You know, I've said that overindulgence is a form of child abuse. It does cripple a child. You see, a child forms their self-image, their self-worth by making attributions to themselves. We watch ourselves in situations and say, wow, I did that. I overcame that. I accomplished that. I did that. I learned about myself that way. So I have confidence that I can do these things. She's saying, you screwed up. You parented me that way. But it's not over. You sure? I'm sure. Yes. <laughs> I guarantee sure. it's not over. Reparenting. So many parents have, to have the opportunity to reparent their child. So you guys need to redefine your relationship. How do we do that? You give her more love and less money. <laughs> and, um, I feel like it's too late for that. Yeah. I don't want love anymore. Well. Do with it as you will, but that's what she needs to have. I, th I, think, I, I think giving this child $5,000 a month, $2,500 a month, $1,000 a month is insane. $1,000? I, I think that's I'm insane. I'm barely living. Yeah. I think that you, as a parent, you're required to give her a stable environment. Which she has. And you, know, you have a roof over her head, feed her make sure she has medical care, take care of her in those ways. I think she needs to get a job. No, I, I think she job. needs. I think she needs to get a job where she works okay. and observes herself doing the things that she's right. capable of doing. Minimum wage isn't gonna get and me my car. Not in a hurry. <laughs> That's why you need an education. So you don't have to work for minimum wage. By the time I was your age, I'd worked at A&W root beer stand on roller skates. I had worked at <laughs> throwing a paper route. At, I'd worked at Pizza Planet. I'd worked everywhere you could get a job. I'm just saying, realize when you indulge her, mm -hmm. you're doing that to make yourself feel, feel better. better. And what you need to do is do what is required for her to be better. And is she going to be unhappy about it? Yes. Yes. Extremely. Yeah. This is what she's going to do at home. This is how um, she's going to pout and act at home. Well, th that's her choice. Correct. But you need to work out something where she becomes productive and makes a contribution to society instead of taking from society. I think the best thing would be to start with a job. No. Yeah, absolutely, no. she needs a job. No! <laughs> and I think it would be great if you volunteered some more at the soup kitchen. You can do some great volunteer work down there. <laughs> I did that. No! I started with a babysitter. I think my first job was at IHOP. Well, you don't pay me to babysit. She makes me babysit for free. She doesn't need a job babysitting. She needs a job in the world. No. She doesn't need Absolutely a job at home. Not. She needs a job Absolutely in the world. I'm sorry. <clears throat> you, you need a job. No, I don't want a job. Well, I know. It's so much work. <laughs> <laughs> but you, I don't 